I intend to bring forth heaven on earth for the benefit of all. I ask forgiveness for my filthy soul. No soul left behind. And this I did in a... This is interesting. The only language that's not related that they found is the Basque language. Uh, they're not even really sure of who the people are. So I wrote there's language there with the same thing. Say this three times in the morning. I say it six times in the afternoon and nine times at night. This has got glow in the dark paint. We'll have to see if it works later. My son brought me some glow in the dark that you can put with different colors. So I'm trying it out. And uh, I call this one Fight Death. <laughs> See, you were born, but you were really a stillborn, or that's what they said you were. This holographic world, or whatever it is, the soul trap is what I call it. It's, it's like a prison planet, yes. <laughs> yes, it is, but you have a way out. All you have to do is write on a piece of paper. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth for the benefit of all. Put a drop of your blood on it. Publish it to YouTube. Tag and title it. Blood over intent. Join us in blood or expire. Just like your mother and your father and your grandmother and your grandfather. See, they didn't know any different. They thought they were going to have to die to go to heaven. And what? Like, does any of this even make sense? Like, any of it? Think about it. And when you start to think about it, and then you start going, where is the mother? Where is the goddess? I mean, you have a mother and you have a father. Why all of a sudden would you just have a father? And just, well, let's just look at it. Everything's just working out just fine, right? Look, it's that simple. There's the center of the flat earth plane where you may go to drink of the Holy of Holies. Look at the song, Follow the Drinking Gourd. Why did the compasses have a little spoon on it so that you may take a little drink? That's why. It's, it's true. You want to believe the sky daddy <laughs> and... Jesus is coming to save you, and I read you that Jesuit extreme oath. Go read it yourself. The Society of Jesus Christ. Really? I'm, I'm just saying. I think you guys need to go read it. And then look. Fauci said that, you know, if it hadn't been for the Jesuit schools, he would have never known what to do during the pandemic, whatever the thing, whatever happened, you know, <laughs> that thing have happened. And then Melanie and Bill, they, they donate a bunch of money to that college or that school. Hmm. Isn't that interesting? I find it very, very interesting. Especially when they say <laughs> they're a corpse in the militia of the Pope in the Society of Jesus Christ. And oh my God, no, we're the other side. See, <laughs> that's what blood over intent is. We swear that we won't lie, cheat, or steal. We're going to create right now Armageddon, right? No, that's what they're trying to create with their Bible. What are we doing? We're agents of the apocalypse. What does that mean? Well, it means we just blew the lid right off of it. 
Quit believing their dirty spells. They lie about everything. I live in New Mexico. I've lived here off and on my whole life. I'm 56 years old. There are things underground. There are underground bases. They're from our military. These are a bunch of people <laughs> with no conscience. A lot of money. Your money, by the way. And all the technology. And they still can't win. They're still trying to eliminate the competition. But yet, the competition's the very thing that's keeping them afloat. Now, when everybody decides to quit buying their products... Oh, and by the way, <laughs> if you're an artist or even just like drawing and coloring and painting, there's a guy on TikTok and he's, he's going to give some kind of bonus away, but he's like doing a contest about all of Vanguard's and BlackRock's, you know... Uh, products that are banned in other countries that we're feeding our children and that we're eating and consuming that aren't real good for you. Well, anyways, he wants people to do boxes, you know, with uh, what they think of those products. And hopefully that'll get it started. Because, you know, all you have to do is say you're charging a bunch of money for poison. No, thank you. Really, that's how it's got to be. You're going to have to break the bank. Since they can just produce these paper, worthless paper, not even having to show. And like most people don't know. Their 100 year lease, it's up. It's up. You guys should have already have left. <laughs> Nuremberg trials. You ever heard of them? Yeah. That's what needs to happen. It's going to happen. And, uh, yeah. Bloody Mary, she's the one that put the queen on her throne. And this Bloody Mary took her off of her throne and broke her wand. Did you see they placed it on her casket? Yes. I meant every bit of that when I did a voodoo painting. Let me tell you what. They have been using some dirty ass spells against you guys from day one. And if you just look at the birth certificate fuckery they got going on, why would they need your soul print? Did you know that everybody's soul print is different like a fingerprint? Huh. Isn't that amazing? It seems like they're using what? Black magic against you. Yep. I'm telling you. Things are not as they seem. Flip it upside down. And then you might be closer to the truth. You need to think about what you're worshiping, what you're buying, and who you... These Hollyweird people, have you seen? Have you seen what they've done? Have you seen? I don't care. I don't care if they sold out. I don't care if they're bribed. I don't care. I do not care. That would teach all of us one good lesson right you cannot worship someone you cannot wait on somebody to come and save you each of us is gods and goddesses each of us has male and female negative and positive life force we are creators they have cut you off at the knees through that cancer cell i'm not sure how yet but we're getting there <laughs> so in the meantime do have blood over in 10. I've been doing them for four or five years. And let me tell you what. Getting better every day. Physical therapy. Four days a week. They said I would be in a fucking wheelchair by now. Guess what? I'm not. But I quit believing everything they said. And I quit taking all the pharmaceuticals. They just farm you on the pharmaceuticals. They do not intend on making you well. They do not intend on making you healthy. And it's up to you to do something. It's always been, what were you going to do about it? Well, there's a girl on here. Uh, I don't know if I put the video up or not. But she talks about, you know, we all have cameras on these phones. And if you're out and about and things are looking shady, you know what? Take some pictures. 
you see buildings that are supposed to be empty, but you see people going in and out of them? You see these little hot spots with their little rabbit, a little white rabbit or pizza or a hot dog? <laughs> Pay attention, people. Pay attention. And you know what? Take some videos. Let me catch y'all. Because <laughs> you know what? Some of us are really tired of this shit with the kids. We've just had enough. And you know what? It's not only are they not stopping, they're trying to ramp it up. So, trying to do it real fast now. And it's too late. It is too late. The parents are aware. And you parents, you tell your children, you tell them to be watchful for each other and themselves. And teach them to bite and kick and do whatever they got to do to get away when somebody's trying to harm them or take them. Yes, you heard me. Teach them to defend their self. Do you know what? An animal teaches their babies to defend their self and to feed their self. That's the least we could do, isn't it? So, I get so tired of people saying, turn the other cheek into, uh, against what? R are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> Boy Scouts, UN, the Catholics, the Baptists, the born again Christians. I don't think there's been one place that's exclusive for not messing with the children. Now, the very places the children are supposed to be safe are where you're going to have to really watch your kids. Right now, I'm going to tell you something. I would have, I homeschooled my kids anyways. Until my girls got in high school. And then when they got to high school, they decided they wanted to go to school with their friends. And I said, yeah. They got in there. They were ahead. They had to put them in advanced classes. <laughs> I'm telling you, it is such a lie. Anyways, if I had to do it all over again, especially now, they wouldn't be in school. I'd break the bank there, too, till they start telling the truth. And our educational system, we did not come from monkeys. We are not on a fucking spinning ball, like, floating through space. This is all a lie. This is a closed-loop system, whatever it is. Whether it's an Earth ship, or a galaxy inside a galaxy, or it's water out there. And it's probably, that's what I'm thinking, ocean. So is above, so is below. And for some reason, Earth ship and Earth suit kind of makes sense to me. Maybe it's just me. But I'm thinking, you know. Remember George Jetson? They had the bubble around the houses and on the little spaceship and then the little bubble. <laughs> I'm just saying. There is so much symbolism that they give to you in all of these things. And we have to be careful because they also call these bad spells. And all you have to do is pay attention. And I just give them a little mirror therapy. See, you know, in that Bible, it talks about if you take one word or add one word to the word, what was going to happen? The plagues of Egypt. Ah, oh, Constantinople. 42, 46 books. I'm not sure. <laughs> That's the ones that we know about. Okay? Okay. I'm just saying, you want to write your dirty spells, you're going to eat them. You're going to eat your words. And me, I'm going to go to the center, and I'm going to come back here. I'm going to plant the giant trees, and I'm going to fix this. And uh, in the meantime, I'm getting better every day. And I say my mantras three times a day. Because if we have heaven on earth for the benefit of all, who would need anything? What else are you going to ask for? You know what they ask for after they sacrifice all these people and these children? Oh, they're sick. They are. You know, I feel sorry for them because they're so pathetic. But they it's kind of that pathetic that makes you, like, throw up in your mouth. Pathetic. Yeah. That's how I see y'all. Better get your hands off the kids and you better run. Because we're coming back here. And 144,000 are revving up. I can feel it. Every day there's another one. 
<laughs> two or three. And you know what? Don't worry. It's coming. In the meantime, be as positive as you can. Help everybody you can. You know what? It pays to be nice. And uh, keep going. They're shadow banning a lot of people, but that's okay. You know how you know you're good is when they take your channel down. My son was proud of me. I was like, son, they took my channel. I had 700 subscribers. And he goes, isn't that good? And you know what? You weren't even sponsored. <laughs> he said, you weren't even getting paid for it. They took you down. That means that you were, you know, that's how they punish people. They take away their sponsorships and their money. And I'm just like, yeah, you know, whatever. <laughs> I wasn't getting paid to do it. I'd do it for free. It's fun. This is so much fun. I'm already up to 400 subscribers now. Yeah, because I'm pushing forward the goddess. And hey, let's look at this. And the children. And, you know, all of it. It's it's coming. More and more people are seeing that, you know, it's us. We control this. And we can take it back. And we need to do that. Every day. First yourself. Inside, okay? Then family. Then friends. Then community. In that order. If you're not well, you're not going to be able to help anybody else. I'm telling you. Blood over intent. It's your only way out. It's like your get out of hell free card. And oh, by the way, the Jesuits, they give them a dagger. And they cut their self and they sign their name in blood to the Society of Jesus Christ and the, the Pimp Daddy Pope. <laughs> I take these, uh, you should check your blood sugar. Okay. One drop on a piece of paper saying we're the opposite of what you guys want. We intend to bring forth heaven on earth for the benefit of all. No one will stop us, stop us, no one will. It's clear who holds the spear of destiny, motherfucker. <laughs>